guys, this is Sarah from Crocheting Lefty, and today we're going to do this stitch right here. Um, my daughter calls it the arrow stitch um, because of the front post triple troubles that you have on the out on the front of your work, um, and the back of the work is just all plain. So I have this yarn here which is going to be done in a J hook and this here is done in a smaller hook, a G hook. So I'm kind of curious to see how it'll come out with a chunkier yarn. So I'll set that side. We're, this stitch is done in multiples of 5 plus 4 and it's pretty simple because you have few rows of single crochet, double crochet, single crochet, double crochet, and then you get into the triple troubles. So we'll start with our slip knot. And I'm going to chain up 15. So I have my 15 and then I'm going to add 4 more. So 1 with a total of 19. Now the first row here is all going to be single crochet. So we're going to skip that, this stitch right here and we're going to do our first single crochet into that second stitch. So yarn, so insert your hook, don't yarn over. <laughs> insert your hook, yarn over, pull through 1 yarn over and pull through two. So you're going to do that stitch for the remaining of this row. And if you'd like you can pause your video here, your film here, and I will meet you back when I'm done. Alright, so we have finished our first row of all single crochet here. Now the second row is going to be a row of double crochet. So we're going to chain up two, one and two, and we're going to do our first double crochet into that very first stitch here. And these chain two, they do not count as a stitch. So yarn over, insert your hook, yarn over, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through two. And you're going to do one double crochet in each stitch across your row. Now you can pause your video here and I will meet you back when I'm done. Alright, so I'm finishing up row two. So you have row one and row two completed. We're going to chain one and our third row is going to be all single crochet. So again, insert your hook into that very first stitch, yarn over, pull through one, and yarn over, pull through two. And you're going to do one single crochet across the row. And I will meet you back. Pause your video and I'll meet you back when I'm done. Alright, finishing up row three here. and we're going to chain up two and our row four is going to be all double crochet. So chain up two, yarn over, insert your hook, yarn over, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through two. So you'll do one double crochet in each chain, each stitch across your row and when you're done we'll move on to row five and then that's when we will start our triple troubles. So we can pause your video and I will meet you back here when I'm done. Alright, so I'm finishing up row four. So our next row is going to be row five and where we're going to be doing our, tri our triple troubles. So we're going to chain up one and we're going to do Sorry about that. We're going to do chain one, do a one single crochet into the first stitch, and then from here, we're going to be working in 
this second row here and we're going to work in the seventh post. So we're going to count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So this post here. To do a triple treble, we're going to yarn over four times. So one, two, three, and four. And we're going to do a front post triple treble into that seventh stitch in row two. So we're going to insert our hook around that post, yarn over, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, two, and two. Now if you need to, you can pull that, that stitch all the way up to the top of that double crochet. Now this counts as a stitch for that stitch here. So we're going to skip that and we're going to do four single crochets in the next four stitches. So one, two, three, and four. Now from here, we're going to skip four double crochets down here. So one, two, three, four. And in that fifth double crochet here, we're going to do a front post triple treble. So yarn over four times, one, two, three, and four. And insert your hook around that post. Yarn over, pull through one. Yarn over, pull through two. 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 And yarn, oops. Yarn over, pull through two. Okay. And again, that stitch here that we just oops that we just created here is we're going to skip that stitch there and we're going to do four more we're going to do four single crochets in the next stitch the four stitches. So one, two, three, and four. We're going to repeat what we just did, skipping four, one, two, three, four, and in that fifth double crochet, triple trouble, yarn over four times, and you recount one, two, three, four. So here's that fifth one. Okay, skip that stitch there, and you should have six, so one, two, three, four, five, six single crochets to go. And we're going to finish off that row. You can pull up to the top of that, those double crochets so it has a nice, it lays nice and flat. And there is your row. Now from here, we're going to chain up two and we're going to do double crochets all the way through the next row. And we're going to repeat row two, three, and four. So double crochet all the way through. And you can pause the video and come back when I'm done. Oh, before you go, make sure as you're working through that you maintain your stitches as you go through and you're not dropping any stitching or adding any stitching. And I'll meet you guys back here. Okay, finishing up row six here. Row seven will be all single crochet, so chain one and work your way across with your single crochet and I will meet you back for row seven which will all be double crochet. Okay, finishing up row six here. Oops, sorry, row seven. Chain two for row eight and all double crochet. And all double crochet across your row 
and I will meet you guys back here for row eight where we will do our triple trebles across the row in the opposite, almost like an opposite direction kind of feel. Okay, wrapping up row eight here and moving on to row nine for our triple trebles. Now with row nine, we're gonna chain up one and we're going to do uh, six single crochets. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Now we're going to be working into the row down here. So in row, what was, what was this? Row five. So we're going to be working into row six. And from here, we're going to work into the second post here. So it's going to come back that way. So we're going to yarn over four times. One, two, three, and four. Now you can simply just drag your, but I found that if I turn my work around like this and work into the post this way, it was easier. And also, my stitch laid nicely. So your stitch will look like that instead of it coming around the other direction. So from here, we're going to skip that stitch there, and we're going to work four double crochets, so one, single crochets, sorry. So one, two, three, and four. And from here, we're going to skip four double crochets down here. So one, two, three, four. And in that fifth double crochet right here, we're going to work our front post triple trouble. So yarn over four times. One, two, three, and four. Turn your work Oh, I lost count of my... One, two, three, four, five, there we go. Insert your hook. Okay, and then from here, oops, sorry, skip that stitch there. Four single crochets, one, two, three, and four. And again, skip four, one, two, three, four, and in that fifth one here, we're going to do one triple, one, two, three, and four. Turn your work around like so. And you'll skip that one there and work your last single crochet into that last stitch. Now from here, you will simply repeat rows two through nine. Sorry, I'm just kind of scooting up that stitch. So you'll chain up two and you'll do your row of double crochet across for your row two repeat and then your row three repeat of single crochet your row four repeat of double crochet and your row five repeat of single crochet with the triple trouble front post double crochet and then again after that you'll have your row repeat of you'll have a row repeat 
of six, which is all double crochet, your row repeat of seven of all single crochet, your row repeat of eight, all double crochet, and your row repeat nine of single crochet with your front post triple crochet, front post triple treble crochet. And that is it. And you'll keep going and doing that until you reach the desired length of, what, of the project that you're working on. And then you want to end on a single crochet row because you started on a single crochet row. So this here would be my final row because I'm going to end this. End this swatch and end this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, hit that like button. And if you'd like to continue watching videos like this, hit that subscribe button and stay tuned. Like always, if you have any questions about any of the stitches that uh, I have made or would you like, if you'd like me to make you a stitch video, a special one just for you, let me know in the comments below and I can get working on that. As always, again, stay healthy and stay safe. Have a good one, you guys.